Hello everyone, it is me, Mr. Sneaky, and it is episode 14 of the Road to Glory series. So let's pick up and summarize everything that actually happened in the live stream for all of you guys that have been looking and not maybe missed out on the live stream, but it is there, you can re-watch the live stream if you guys want to. Um, but I'm going to go over it right here, a nice summary of where we're at, especially where we're moving forward to. Okay, so stay tuned for all the updates on episode 14, Road to Glory, here with me, Mr. Sneaky. So yes guys, we're here, we are back almost in the main cluster. So basically what's been happening on our survey in recent times is basically this area here had been covered. It's been a little bit of a fight as you can see with DS. So we've got DS up here with the big super boys. So we've got Kratos right now, big 33 million power player as well as you can see Zahini right there. So if you go to the rankings, you can see these DS members, it's rank 1, 3 and 4. In the kingdom are trying to cause big problems, having a, maybe a little bit fun for themselves, obviously, within that, right? So, with all that said, that's basically what's been going on in the kingdom. L little, you know, summary for you guys. We've been obviously helping out on the account. We've had a little bit of fighting, so that's why we do have a little bit of extra merits from last time. We haven't done anything crazy. We've been a bit busy ourselves, uh, but... What we have done, guys, is complete the wall to 17, which means we did do the foundry, the hospital, all the way to 17. We also did the school of sages to 17, as well as we need to upgrade the alliance center eventually to level 17 before we pop our sacred hall. It would make us, obviously, go through a little bit quicker for everything. So now all we're working on is the Rangers Retreat. We're really happy where our buildings are at because we are very mage and, obviously, archer focused. So our two main buildings that we're going to be using, so the mages and archers, are going to be, you know, trained up, which is more important. So we've almost done all of the T2 units. Which means we can just train hard 850 tier 3 units then. And by doing that, obviously we've maximized the amount of troops that we can use. We've used our speed ups accordingly to upgrade the T1s into tier 3 as well. And then once we've done all of that, obviously we've only got T3 units left. We're going to be just training T3 fresh. on, And then obviously on the way, we will be doing our tech right so you can see from the live stream we've done a little bit more extra progress we're here intelligence gathering which is really nice we've done two points into the attack and we're about to do the same here i do believe if my memory serves me right as a you know long serving player these need to be at least rank three in order for this to be finished later on which will allow you at city hall 21 to then complete any of your tier 4 researchers we will be completing archers first because we are an archer main so at the moment what we've been doing in our downtime though is trying to complete some of this extra research to make our ranged unit stronger which has been really nice we've also been doing our policies to actually increase the amount of hero xp we get but as you can see we've already maxed it out so now we need to finish off the rest of basically the back trees now um, in order to progress these later trees so we've got a nice amount of troop cap as you can see we've maxed out 8,000 there we've got another a massive amount of 9,000 here and another 13,000 and we have a plenty as you can see guys we've got plenty of prestige in order for us to hit any of these later ones very you know high right so we're doing very well right now we're stocking up we've also which is a really big announcement and i'm going to keep it until the very end of the video if you really want to see it but during the live stream um live stream guys we did manage to get him we got nico boys we're able to get him leveled up we automatically got him as well to trust level five to get the emoji as well as the more importantly 10 sculptures and we leveled the first skill already to level two so we're going to be working on nico very soon because as well just to show progress right here we're only you can see only 2700 
and 70 gems away guys and we are going to be at vip 8 meaning we're going to be able to now pick nico and actually level up our archers and the cool thing with this as well guys as you guys have been wondering we're at day 20 of the account so this is really reasonable if you're in a very active alliance and you even even if you do more gem farming because i've not really done that much the only gem farming i've done is what i've spoke about in a previous episode as well as on the live stream i did do the quick 150 gems to get a secondary builder to upgrade both of these at the same time so we could get above at least a level 13 on both of these this had to be level 60 a uh, 17 shall i say in order for us to complete our main quest so that's the reason why we did that so now all we've got to do is upgrade our sacred hall again which is going to be our next rule once we finish the rangers retreat all the way to level 17 which is really good because it's going to help us obviously scout more so if you guys have noticed as well, we finally as well completed all the regions on the outside again. We can now scout into the free zone twos, which is amazing because we do have already 99 plus scout triggers, which means I can now fully claim all the rewards as you're going to see in the um, Lorcan region here. So we can do it all in Lorcan. We're going to start doing Agoru next. So that's going to be fully done. So we'll have completed all of the zone twos on the right side. And then what we are going to finish off is this region right here. Um, you can see on screen we did manage to hit the amazing observatory. If you're wondering how, if you're in the Navula region like we are, and you unlock zone two, if you actually click to scout this square right here, and this square right here what happens is your scouts will go through and one of them will detour through the right touching the observatory area and then the other one will go left so you can get that really quick observatory pop and if you really wanted to you could start scouting as you can see from here and outwards and complete all of that zone two as well so that's what we're going to be focused on soon in the game we are still at a little bit of a war so we're going to do a little bit of fighting later run hopefully i'm going to record that too for you guys we've done a load of videos as well for the channel if you're wondering what we've been busy so there's been a little bit as you can see a little bit of delay in the last episode compared to this episode in how many days it's been so do apologize for that but we've been able to obviously help you guys grow and learn something new with behemoth raids as well as some other juicy guides and tips that i've been putting out for you right so that's where we're at so far. We're going to be pushing obviously forward into our sacred hall. So if we go back into our heroes right now, we also we've um, got a magic um, extra unit. So obviously we've got Nico right here. But in the ending of this Road to Glory episode, if you stay stick around, you will see the live highlight. Literally, it was a live stream. I'll just rip it out as you can see my raw reaction. Of when I opened the chest, it was absolutely just unreal. I was so hyped that we got um, Nico, but we like did get some extra surprises. So I'll keep that for you guys to check out. Um, but we did also on stream, as you're gonna see, manage to max out Bomb Flinger. So it is level 44 star. We're getting over 38 percent, boys, in that Legion attack uh, maximum attack, shall I say? for our marches which is basically allowing us to compete in the raids and get high rankings and potentially steal a top five position if we've been really good right our damage is on skill three so if you look wondering we're at level three on our skill so we've almost as well got it maxed out so that's the reason why we've chosen on this account to max bomb flinger heart piercer is what we've been doing on the side but as you can see it's still level one so that's why we've not hard focused on it but maybe Maybe, you know, if we get some more extra skills, that's when we can go really hard and finish this and get it four-starred. But at the moment, we're just happy leveling it up and using it as a two-star artifact right now. Also, our mage artifacts we've not been able to hit, which has been a bit, you know, a bit of a downer right now. We've still got, obviously, the PvE one, but again, it's still a level one fire burst. We need it higher level so we can use our mages artifacts more often again in the raids. This spirit bangle for us at the moment is actually a lot better. It gives us legion HP for obviously um, PvP. 
But when you're in, for example, the Hydra raid, or even when you're in the Dire Bear raid, you can use this Spirit Bangle to either cleanse some of the toxic poison stacks on you, or in the Dire Bear raid, you can use it to again cleanse the floor and get rid of some of that purple mist that's placed by the Behemoth. So there, that's what we're at with our artifacts. We've also got Solomon's Blade for a daily freeze. So don't freak out when you see that. We're not going to be using it at all at the moment. So that is the account, guys. That is Road to Glory Episode 4 pretty much complete. We've gone over the heroes. We've gone over the items or artifacts, shall I say, where we're at at the moment. We're going to be emptying our CP very shortly, so don't you worry. We're going to be also using all our CP because of the Elena's event. So what we've been doing as well, saving our CP here. So we're going to be using all this CP as well just to get as many of these speed ups as we can from the Elena's Crisis because you do get some juicy, juicy rewards as well as those summon puppets to get Elena. So we've got a bunch of XP here what we're going to use later on, so don't you worry. We're going to see who needs it um, and then obviously update you guys where we're at. So we're at almost 1.9 million power, so we're almost closing down the 2 million goal. Really, really good. Day 20 again on the account. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the series so far, showcasing again, a free to play player is able to easily micromanage and be very competitive in the game, especially when you come into PvE content. At the moment, we've not been really fighting too much, We ha but when we have as well, we've been able to do some nice little bit of fighting, and obviously you can see that it's going to be on the stream as well. As some parts of other you know areas like the nasty alliance went through against lg65 so you're going to see again some t1 t3 gameplay there which is really fun so i hope you guys stay tuned for that but if you enjoyed that episode smash a like comment and subscribe to the channel guys i am a sneaky always whipping out call it dragons content but with all that said we're going to do a nice little smooth transition we're going to keep the music playing we're going to allow you guys to watch the stream highlight of me opening 10 keys and getting Nico. So I hope you enjoyed the episode, but until the next one, peace out guys and enjoy the highlight. See if we get lucky, we might get hopefully a Nico. Forget that Nico, it'd be nice. It'd be nice. Let's do it, let's do it. Oh, it's a legendary. Oh, oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go boys. Love it. We hit him, dude. We finally got him. We can straight away do it, dude. Oh, oh, we got Fela too. Oh my god, that's so nuts. No. <laughs> oh my god. Finally. I finally got some luck. It's finally coming. No way, dude. Live on stream. If you're a low spender as well, guys, you must be buying this bundle. If you're a low spender, $4.49, $4.99 on the mobile phone, you do get 10 legendary heads. So you must be buying this, but hot damn, boys. Clip that.